Hey everyone, today we're going to work on our addition sum. So we know that addition means the same as plus. So what we're going to start with is we're going to start by breaking up our numbers and making sure we have all the hundreds together, we have all the tens together, and we have all the units together. So we're going to start with our first sum for today and our first sum is going to be 135. We know that it is an addition sum, it is a plus sum, so I'm going to add my operational sign plus 235. 42. Now, I have my addition sign, my plus sign. I also need to have my equal sign. So I'm going to make a really big equal sign to put the answer of my sum. Now, when you do sums like this, you always start at the back. We're first going to add the units then we're going to add the tens and finally we're going to add the hundreds so let's think five plus two what is five plus two seven let's add our tens three plus four what is three plus four seven and let's add our hundreds. One plus two. What is one plus two? Three. And there's our answer. 377. I've got three hundreds, seven tens, and seven units. It's pretty simple. But sometimes it can get a little bit tricky. So I'm going to give you another sum today. We're also going to do hundreds, tens, and units. Now, our sum's going to get a little bit bigger. We're going to say 243 we know that we are doing an addition sum, a plus sum. So I'm going to add my operational sign plus 127. Once again, I'm going to add a really big equal sign because that is where I'm going to be putting my answer today. Now, do you remember where we start? We always start at the back. We're first going to add the units, then the tens, and then the hundreds. So we're going to start with the units. Three plus seven. Do you know what three plus seven is? The answer is ten. Oh no, but now I've got a problem. I can't write ten here because I can only write one number. And I know that 10 is made up of a 1 and a 0. Well, we always start with the back. So I'm going to write the last number of 10. And the front number, I'm going to actually give to my neighbor. Because when we've got too much, it's always kind to share. So if your unit can't carry the number because the number's too big, we're going to give it over to our neighbor, the tens. So let's work on our tens. What is four plus two? It's six. But don't forget the one. What is six plus one? Seven. And let's do our hundreds. Two plus one. Three. And there's our answer. 370. We have three hundreds, seven tens, 
and zero units. So remember, if you don't have enough, always be kind and give some to your neighbor. Good job with your maths today.